all right guys we're back to watch the next episode of tokyo avengers now i did say this last episode but as we just find out or takamichi finds out more and more of what happened in the past i'm beginning to understand why mikey grows up to be this really fucked up person brother getting murdered draken gets murdered he murders somebody it's just trauma after trauma after trauma and honestly i i can understand i can i can understand why he grows up and doesn't become the best person to lead toman but in this case he based off what draken said he is the leader of valhalla now and somehow kisaki weaseled himself like i mean we see how he weaseled himself in there but because draken lived he doesn't become number two which is mind-boggling because he plotted as a young kid kisaki plotted to get draken killed he set up that whole he knew exactly how payon and Peichen was set up the whole thing to get uh Peichen, uh pachin's friend and the girl beat up and just violated it's just because he knew that pachin was going to act out and try to kill or stab osanai which in turn he just how does he know all this how is it how does he know all this to me i think he's like a, a time traveler he's got to be like some type of time traveler he's got to have a manual that tells him step by step what you got to do and what leads to what because honestly how he's like he is like up there with schneezel and lelouch okay <laughs> how does he do it i think it's cool well not even cool but it's great draken lived which I know Kisaki was probably pissed about that. He was probably pissed about that. So he couldn't become number two. We, we, you know, we were able to push him back. Takamichi was able to hold him back a little bit. But he's, it's still not enough. Now, the next important thing is, is to keep him from, keep Mikey from murdering Kazutora. That's what he's got to do. And based off what we saw in that little flashback we saw last episode, Mikey clearly still is holding on to the anger the vengeance that he has for Kazutora and I don't blame him like I honestly can't blame him there's nothing I can't even I would never be like you gotta forgive him no he killed your brother totally understandable but him killing Kazutora messes him up mentally it's gonna it messes him up but with Draken being there Takamichi being there now more so for interference now that 26 year old Takamichi will be there be there it will hopefully we can keep him from doing that but honestly i feel so bad for takamichi because he's got to do so much and he only has one shot to do it he can't go back and keep redoing it so as we're going on it's like the challenge is just getting harder and harder and i i hope keisuke keisuke and chifuyu trying to expose kasaki speaking of keisuke i want to know how did Keisuke even find out he Keisuke probably already thought it was suspicious that um uh Kisaki from Obius is showing up to Mikey and then trying to like kiss his, kiss his ass and stuff you know what I'm saying what I also want to know is how did Kisaki persuade Hanma to listen to him to be the acting commander to you know what i'm saying how does kisaki and hanma know each other i can't remember if takamichi's friend explained that because kisaki was the leader of what the 2000 mobius kids like the second generation osanai was the leader of like the first generation of mobius i can't remember where hanma fits in there i cannot remember I'll probably have to go back and see. But how did Kisaki persuade a, a guy like Hanma, that psychopath? You know what I'm saying? Maybe Hanma saw what happened. He probably witnessed and saw everything that Kisaki did with Osanai. You know what I'm saying? For him to like put trust in Kisaki, like, okay, I'll listen to him. But I don't know. Let's get started. Let's see. Let, let's see what happens before I ramble. Cause you guys know I can talk. I can talk for the next ten minutes. But uh, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Yeah, Kisaki's goal was to kill Draken, but that didn't work. Is Kisaki becoming number two? Yeah. Bad. But how did Mikey become the leader of Valhalla? 
How did that how did that switch happen? But how is a gang that was put together for Mikey? Like what do you mean? Now you guys were try one of y'all was trying to tell me um that comment that Kisaki said that the moon can't shine on its own. I'm, I'm wondering what he means by that. Mikey was never caught? Because... What? Prepared a what for him? Patsy? Mikey was probably the reason Kisaki wanted to join in the first place. What? Baji was killed? What? How? How? <laughs> what? I just thought Baji was knocked out in the flashback, but he was dead. Okay. Kazutora probably found out that Baji was playing double agent and he was like, <laughs> blah, blah. Mikey was never caught. I'm going to have to go to dictionary.com and look up what Patsy? Pat, Pat, Patsy? What, did he, what word did he use? What? Did he mean to say alibi or like a fall guy for him? Kusaki prepared. Prepared. Kusaki knew Mikey was going to kill Kazutora and Baji. Alright, I killed Kazutora, not Baji. Kusaki, that dude. I'm sorry, Kusaki's that girl. Like I said. <laughs> How does he do it? If I was Takamichi, I'd be depressed too. That's crazy. Yeah, that goes against everything he believes in, but... I have no idea why I'm seeing him. Reminds me of Ferris, shit. Yes, bring Baji back. He's got to bring Baji back to Toman. He's like, we got a damn. First was Drake and now Baji. Takamichi is an amazing person. Like, he's done so much already. Oh. 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 Oh, she got matching ones. How sweet. <laughs> She's like, wait, you crying over this? <laughs> How does Takamichi act when he's not there? That's what I want to see. <laughs> Mm. Look, Draken, Peacemaker. Right. What's your explanation? Oh. He said two years. Two years. Bitch, you killed his brother. What do you expect? He said, I spent two of my precious years. Yes, you did. You what? You thought you weren't supposed to spend two years with Juby? You lucky you got that. He said, that's exactly what I don't like about you. I just want to know what's going on inside Kazutora's head. Like, I wish we could hear him narrate or just hear him just... I don't know. I sometimes I'd be forgetting that they are really in middle school. <laughs> oh, is Keisuke visiting his grave? I wonder if Kazutora knows that Baji is a double agent. He's just acting like he don't know. It, how much is that? All you do, just sit there, brooding, just. 
smiling mischievously. Is that all you do? What do you do in your free time, Hanma? I want to know. Well, you got any friends? Like, what? Do, what's your hobbies? Okay, it's October 30th. One more day until it's Halloween. Right? 31st, right? Dang, Chifuyu's eye got fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> he said you want to get your ass beat again? <laughs> Damn. That's right. Chifu said Naji never said that he really was doing that. Don't trust anyone who's not your friend. How? I want to know how Takamichi is going to talk to Baji. Is he going to tell him the truth? I'm a time traveler, you die. That is so sad. Like, Baji is Mikey's childhood friend. Oh no. You made up your mind for what? Please don't make up. Oh gosh. Oh god. How, like, uh, how is he gonna. How's he gonna do this? How's he gonna do this? Here goes Kisaki's bitch ass. Dang, they gotta. If you in a gang like this, you really gotta be able to yell <laughs> and project that voice. Kisaki, you, uh, your ass better not be smiling. Like, he's over there, like. <laughs> he said, I'm gonna get real childish for a sec. <laughs> Look at Kasagi so <laughs> Kasagi's like god damn it Wow Okay Oh Kasaki is shook He's like oh said this is what I wanted? What? This is- Oh, Kisaki, he's like, this is exactly what I thought you were gonna do. Man, I thought he was shook. I thought he was about to be like, damn. Ugh. But why do he seem so surprised? He seemed so surprised that this was gonna happen. He was like, this is exactly what I wanted. Is he just constantly shook that things are going his way? All the delinquent bosses. Who are they? For Rumpongi. That's Lean Man. Oh, wow. Interesting. Oh, wow. Interesting. Gotta love the politics of gang life. <laughs> Wow, we got someone overseeing the fight? Ikebuko or criminal. I'm keep cool and watch today. Oh, wow. This is low key, high key scary. Oh, wow. Wow, I like the organization. You gotta appreciate the management of war, I guess. I wasn't expecting it to be this organized. Okay, the high- what's their name? The High Tiny Brothers? They look pretty cool. I love the style. But they are for Rumpongi. He said, if this fight sucks and I wasted my time, you're both- I'm kicking all y'all's asses. 
How are they, like, how is this? I thought it was just going to be a straight out brawl. Oh, five on five with your best guys, okay. Or an all out melee. Oh. Just to let you know, we just want ba Baji back. Ooh, tell him, Draken? <gasps> oh! Oh, okay. He said overseeing the fight. Conditions. Oh, wow. Kazutora is not playing. All right, we're doing the melee. It's funny that it says safety first in the background. No! Uh, wow, okay. God, that went by so fast. Now, one thing that stuck out to me, Kisaki. First off, he seemed irritated about Mikey's behavior. It was like as if he was expecting Mikey to behave a certain way. And the moment Kisaki, and I'm, the moment Mikey was like, I'm gonna act childish real quick. He kind of was like, what the fuck? But then when Mikey did what he did, he was like, this is exactly what I wanted. Why did he seem so shocked? Is is Kisaki following a handbook or a manual? Like, what is going on? Like, I don't know. It seemed like Kisaki, he's just like, he's just like doing shit and he's seeing if it works out and then he's like oh shit it actually worked <laughs> like that's what that how that came across to me so i don't know what's going on but that's i wouldn't be surprised if kasaki is kind of like takamichi i don't know now chifuyu went to baji and was like hey you, you you really are trying to expose kasaki right right and baji was like what are you talking about <laughs> I'm, I'm hoping that he, he really is and he was just acting like that because maybe Baji was being watched. Who knows? I'm, 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 I'm putting my faith into Baji and I'm putting my trust into Chifuyu that he really knows his captain as well as he says he does. But I, I have faith in Baji. Now, I didn't expect Baji to also be killed. Like, I wasn't expecting him to also be killed. But seeing how Kazutora knocked that one dude out, the, the guy who was overseeing the fight... I could see him, I mean he did kill Shinichiro with one hit with a weapon, what if he did that to Baji, he hit him upside the head so hard to provoke Mikey because he hates him so much. But Draken tried to talk to him, he tried to ask him like why do you hate Mikey so much, Mikey you spoke in your favor and the only thing he said was I spent two years of my life, bitch what the fuck did you expect? You killed someone. You killed someone. Like, yeah, so? Two years? That's not even it. That's nothing. So I want to know what is Kazutora's, what is the real reason? Like, what's the real reason? Do we get that explanation? D-Chan, do we get a real explanation or not? Please let me know. Anyways, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will get back to you guys later. Bye.